Hey, what's going on, you guys? Hey, what's going on? Today I'm here with a video, and this video is going to be very different because I am going to do a haul video on what I got from Trinidad. Oh, God! So, with that, let's get started with that. Okay, the first thing that I bought um, is this Swiss uh, spicy tomato ketchup. I don't know if you ever had Trinidad ketchup, but it's kind of like a garlicky, nice flavor ketchup. I don't really like the ketchup here too much in the States. It's too acidic for me. So I love, 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 love this. So I couldn't wait to try that. So, you know, this thing was number one, real number one. I mean, I couldn't think of nothing else, okay? So after that, I got some big food. No, there is not, you know, people with big foot in this bag. No, no, no. It's some like, kind of like Cheetos, you know, and it, I love this as a kid. I love this. I thought this was just, you know, so good. So, oh God, I can't wait to be done so I can just, you know, eat the bag. So, that is that. So, I got some seasonings. You know, I got some um, chief chicken seasoning. Come closer. I got some uh, jerk seasoning from the Maggie. I don't know, like again, I don't really see this in Orlando. So, you know, this thing's I, that I used to getting in Trinidad and I got some uh, chow min seasoning which I really really like too and I got some all-purpose seasoning I don't know if you can see it here really good and I you know again I love to cook so these are just some seasonings that I couldn't get here locally and plus you know with my Callaloo box and stuff they send me so much nice different things so it was just great you know going to Trinidad and seeing the products in Trinidad and you know with Callaloo box sending me the stuff too so it was just great to know that and I had to go through that hassle of getting products but I was just really glad for the seasoning and oh you know I love spicy stuff so they made me a big job pepper sauce oh lord so I'm just so excited to just take a spoon and try and try and try to eat all that because it's just good but uh, my grandfather made this and he was adding a little twist so you know he was doing his thing and my grandfather you know he was in my blogs and trying to ask him, you know you guys you guys make sure to check that out so um this was very sentimental to me i had to buy back my trinidad pendant because my mom bought me one last year and i actually lost it so it was just really really hard for me so i had to buy a new one so this is it and this is real gold and i bought this in port of spain and i think i'll let me see i have the details here Oh, excuse me, my out of focus. I got the details here. And the details is, um, I bought this at, oh God, sorry people. It looked like Cons Gold Design Limited, um, Frederick Street, Port of Spain. And I bought this for 350 TT, which is like about $75 US. So I was really happy about that. I just only bought the pendant. I'm just going to buy back the gold chain and stuff it somewhere here but i'm going to take good care of that because i don't want to be losing my jewelry again and then i bought some moringa mint peppermint tea and uh, if you don't know about moringa in my last vlog i'll i'll list everything below it has a lot of nice benefits so again i haven't seen this here so i was like oh moringa I have to try it so i was just really excited and i, I took some and i gave some to my co-workers I'm waiting for them to tell me how they like it. I liked it. I thought it was really good. It gave me like a really nice stimulated energy throughout the day when I tried it. And then next, I got, let me see if you can see this properly. I'll come up. Uh, it's my official Trini Lyman shirt. So when I lime in with all my friends and them, I could wear it. So, you know, every Trini or jamaican caribbean person american whoever they have their you know things that just makes you show off your pride within your nationality and this is definitely it so i couldn't go nowhere without this shirt at all at all at all so i was excited about that and i got some plums preserved plums so which was really really nice too oh my gosh we got about 10 bags you know we only have one left everybody fume, fume, 
Pew. Just eat all of them, you know. So this don't last. This don't last at all. So it's like a sweet, nice flavor. I, I love these too. They're really, really good. Okay. And then, you know, I couldn't leave Trinidad. What a big bag of tamarind balls. Oh, yes. So, tamarind balls is like, uh, you know, like a tamarind plant. So, it's kind of like sweet and, and it also has peppery, depending on your like. Uh, I'm just going to list the description below because I just, I talk about tamarind. You're going to be like... Sitting here all day. So, uh, you know, I could have gone away without that. So I bought some of the magnets and keychains, and this is to give to some of my friends. So this one, I don't know if you can get it in focus. Okay, this is how it looks. Hmm. So, so cute. I, so, so cute. And let me show you how I did, I did magnets. Trying to be gone. Somebody foot cock up there on the beach, partner. Hey! And look at the moon. Look at the sun, the sun, the sun. Look at the... <laughs> I gotta tell you, Trinidad is a fun place, definitely. So, those are just, you know, little souvenirs that I, I plan to give to some of my friends and stuff. I can't really say family because we're all from Trinidad and they're gonna be like, well, Danielle, you, know, you give me that. I appreciate it, you know, but yeah. Would I prefer something? That's just understandable. From here, I have a half a loaf of a sweet bread. I could try to show y'all a picture of this. My grandma, June, I have two grandmas, by the way. So, I have a couple of grandmas. She makes the best sweet bread. And it looks like this. It's kind of like a fruit cake, I guess you could say, in, a, in America. And she makes the best sweet bread. We had about four people. We're down to this yeah it's it's that serious it's, it really is so i will list you know what sweet bread is all about and last you know i couldn't go anywhere i got this towel it's like the trinbago towel and then it also shows trinidad Now let's see. It shows you the part of Trinidad. I'm from this area here. St. George. I'm from there. And then Dakota Arms is on the towel. So this towel is going to be with me all summer. Eh? So since I'm in my Trini wardrobe, I hope you guys enjoyed my haul video of all the things that I brought back from Trinidad. And those was just a few. And I, if I could, I would just pack the whole of Trinidad in my suitcase and we gone just like that but you know unfortunately we couldn't do that this time but thanks for watching if there's some other suggestions or if there's some things that you like to bring back from your country or when you're traveling please let's talk below later guys